Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna make a mega juice now. I've had a few things in the fridge that needed to be eaten, so I'm gonna make a mega juice. This is dedicated to my good mate on YouTube, Scream Crawface, because he's about to get into juicing, and uh, this might help him out. So just rough. This is just a great green juice, but um, I've added a few extras that I wouldn't normally put in, like I put in some beetroot. Don't, you don't have to put that in. I've just had a couple of carrots left over, you don't have to put that in. But basically it's lemon, ginger, um, I have two kinds of cabbage, so I've done a half a cabbage of each. Beetroot, cucumbers, put two cucumbers in this one. Um, lettuce, sorry not lettuce, celery. Um, I've normally put more in but I only had one left. Um, there's two types of kale here and there was two types of spinach. Yeah, because I had a load, I just had a load and it just needed in. Now I got this kale from the local farm shop. Um, purple kale. That's, there must be some great, great minerals in there that your body will just be crying out for. I got a big bag of this for about £1.10. Um, I'm using about a quarter of a bag just to just to add some of those minerals over there. Um, and so yeah, so if anybody wants to make a juice, Use apples to make the, the flavour sweet until you get used to it. Um, if you put the apples in, it will taste it will taste really, really nice. You will love it. Um, and then when you get a bit more um, into, you know, hardcore, you can start to cut the apples down. Um, but I leave them in me because because I'm, I'm a sugar-free kind. I, I run on sugar and the apples give me that extra boost. So, okay, I'm going to put these through the juicer now. Oh, little tip, do it this way, put it through a strainer into a bowl, okay, just, just trust me on that, I've been juicing for four years now, I've tried it every which way but loose, this makes the best juice, because you don't want those little bits in there, okay, when you're making juice, you make, you, you, you're refining it all down into a, an easily um, ingestible liquid, so you want to be able to just throw it in your mouth, if it's got little bits in it, you'll be like, yeah, poof, poof, you don't want that. Okay, so just trust me on this. Use a strainer into a bowl, from the bowl into a jar, and from the jar either into your body or into a glass into your body. Okay, so I'll um, keep going and let's see what it looks like at the end. Pause your bugger. Right, I also want to show you how quickly um, I can wash up a, a juicer. You can do it in about one and a half minutes, sometimes less if I'm rushing. Um, so don't give me any of that bullshit that it's a pain to, to pain to clean. Once you get good at it, you can do it. Right, now I've, I've, drunk all, I've drunk my juice, but I want to give another tip. Get yourself one of these jars, or a kiln a jar, okay, as long as it's airtight, and make, make a, a big batch all at once, okay, and then save it in the fridge and you can get two or three days worth all at once so the next morning you just come and make it all down because I know a lot of people are whinging about people whinge about everything about making it and cleaning the juicer and it is a bit of a pain but the benefits are well worth it um, so you know who I'm talking to Mr. Scream Crowface yeah get on it mate I've been, I've been nagging you for a while Sangeeta you know it's all about the sugar Karen and Karina yeah, I know you're doing all right, but keep it up. Andrea, yeah, you need to be uh, coming down more often for some, I think. Um, I know everybody else who's, who's into juicing now, come on, keep it up. It's well worth it. If it's a pain in the ass, knock it back down to just a carrot and apple. Yeah, add a bit of ginger, add a bit of spinach. You've got yourself a top, top meal in one drink. Right, I'll keep it short. Peace be with you guys.